Hi friends, this is Shivang here and uh, today I'm going to throw some light on the topic reflex action. Reflex action is the simplest form of response in the nervous system. It is a rapid automatic response without thinking or any thought like uh, pulling our hand away on pricking a pen or unknowingly touching to the hot object. For example, in the bright light, the pupils of our eyes get smaller. The reflex action protects the retina from damage because of too much light. Similarly, coughing is an another example of reflex action which clears our windpipe. Some other examples of reflex actions are a knee jerk, blinking eye, yawning, movement of diaphragm, sneezing, etc. Therefore, the reflex action can be defined as an unconscious and involuntary response of the muscles or glands to a stimulus. Therefore, the reflex action is an automatic process. Now, let's talk about reflex arc. What is reflex arc? The nerve impulse pathway involved in a reflex action is known as reflex arc. For example, suppose a person incidentally touches a hot object or a hot plate then the thermoreceptors in the skin generates or triggers an electrical impulse or a nerve impulse which is carried by the sensory neurons then this sensory neurons transmits this nerve impulse to the spinal cord and then as is, as it is a life threatening situation the spinal cord immediately takes the decision and generates a stimulus which is carried by the motor neuron and then this motor neuron transmits the stimulus to the muscles of our hand or muscles of our hand and then this muscle contracts and pull away the hand from that hot object and or a hot plate here the muscles of a hand are called effectors because it responds to the stimulus generated by spinal cord we've been thinking that uh, here uh, in a diagram there is a relay neuron and I have not talked about this it's not much of importance a neuron relay neuron is a neuron which forms a connection between other neurons here it is forming a connection between sensory neuron and motor neuron from where an uh, impulse from a sensory neuron passes to the motor neuron so it is a junction after this uh, life-threatening situation uh, after one second, a message is passed to the brain that this happened. So that's all about reflex action and reflex arc. See you guys in the next video. Have a nice day.